Today's a two energy day with a five energy month and year and a king of hearts influence. So we're seeing um, a lot of high emotions running today. You may be feeling this for yourself already. And you know, if your um, emotional state is not what you would like it to be, then the invitation is to go within first and um, center yourself. The king would do this. The king would, um, would make sure that he's got his own um, emotional state in check before he goes out and interacts with the world. And that's the difference between a king or a tyrant, which is why I labeled this video as such today. You know, the tyrant would act out emotionally and, you know, wanting to get their own way and using their power and, you know, abusing their power um, to emotionally manipulate others. Um, that's, that's the low side of the king of hearts. And the invitation today is to step into the high side, which is, you know, um, expressing love, gratitude, appreciation, um, giving and receiving that openly and willingly, and not from a place of manipulation, but a place of authenticity. And it's difficult for us to come from that place of authenticity if we don't have a, a strong foundation for self-love. And the pull today with the two can also be not just um, wanting to connect with people, but could be wanting to argue with people. And so, um, you know, with the emotions running so high, you, if, even if you're not in that state, you may run into people who are looking for a fight. And so the, um, the caution I would give you today is to be on the lookout for that. Just be aware of it, not looking for it, but be aware of it that you may run into people who are um, acting out today and trying to get their way and trying to be right. And um, and to, you know, the, the high side of the King of Hearts is just to have compassion for those people, but not step into the drama. And how do we not step into the drama? Well, first and foremost, we make sure that we're taking really good care of ourselves. The best way to stay out of drama is to get enough sleep, to make sure you're feeding yourself good foods, to make sure you're nurturing your mind, your emotions, your soul, and, um, and your physical needs all at the same time. So the king is the master of this, and especially the king of hearts, um, really having that emotional mastery today is going to help you. So make sure you're going within, um, for my brain game students, practicing PETA, prioritizing your emotions first, and then go out to the world.